What's up, Mitten Squad? My name is Paul. Welcome back to another top 10 video. In this video, I'll be going over 10 things you didn't know about Bioshock. This video is not just about a single Bioshock game, it is about the entire Bioshock series. It's worth mentioning that if you are a big fan of Bioshock, you may know some or all of the things that I go over in this video. Number 10. Father Comstock's name may be based off the Comstock Laws, a group of laws prohibiting the sending of any obscene materials, contraceptive devices, or information to the U.S. Postal Service. These laws were named after Postal Inspector Anthony Comstock, who was considered by many to have stepped far outside the bounds of his legal power. Number 9. One abandoned variant of the Big Daddy was the Slow Pro, also known as the Slow Profum by the development team. It would maul players with an enormous hook and would fire iron barons from a barrel. To fire its weapon, the Slow Pro would kneel on the ground and track the player. Slow Profum stood for Slow Projectile Fucked Up Melee. Number 8. In the cemetery containing Lady Comstock's mausoleum, you can explore the gravestones to the left of her body. One of the graves, the only grave with legible handwriting, says Snite in bold letters. This is the personal signature of Mike Snite, one of the game's environmental designers. Number 7. During the scene where you first meet Elizabeth, she tears a hole in reality to Paris. There's a theater there showing, and I'm sorry for mispronouncing this, La Revenge des Jedi, which translates to The Revenge of the Jedi. This was the original name of Star Wars Episode 6, Return of the Jedi. Number 6. When in front of the ticket salesman for the First Lady airship, if you do nothing or demand the tickets, the salesman will stab you in the right hand, making Booker wear a bandage around his hand for the rest of the game. This is considered canon, as this is how Booker is seen in all of his promotional art, and even in the front cover. Number 5. A teleportation plasmid was planned for the original Bioshock, but it was cut from the game as it could be used to break the game's script during certain events. This plasmid was referenced as an easter egg in Bioshock 2 in the Fontaine Futuristics level as an unstable teleport plasmid that teleports around the level when the player interacts with it. Number 4. After Booker first sees the Monument Island statue and receives the telegram from Lutis, if you approach the telescope to the left and look through it, you can see the twins at the bottom left of the screen. Robert will be juggling as Rosalind watches. Exit the telescope though, and they are nowhere to be found. Number 3. The whispers you hear when using the progression vigor is dialogue from Shakespeare's Romeo and Juliet played in reverse. A longer version with some extra lines can be found by extracting the audio from the PC version of Bioshock Infinite's game files. Part of this is used when you get the vigor, and the rest can be heard being whispered to victims of possession during combat. Number 2. In Bioshock Infinite, there's a bar called Graveyard Shift Bar located in Shantytown. If you head down to the cellar, a guitar can be found. Elizabeth will state, I wish I could play. And if the player interacts with the guitar, Booker will start playing, and Elizabeth will sing along. Be unbroken by and by, by and by. Number 1. The following spoils the ending to Bioshock Infinite. Click the annotation on the screen to skip past it. While in Rapture, Booker uses the Bathy Spears for transport. According to an audio log in Bioshock, the Bathy Spears were locked to Andrew Ryan's genetic code, and because Jack, the protagonist from Bioshock, had similar DNA to Ryan, he was able to use them. This may imply that both Booker and Elizabeth are somehow related to Andrew Ryan. Alright, that's gonna do it for this top 10 video about Bioshock. If you learned anything new, like the video. If you just enjoyed the video, like the video. Dislike the video if you didn't learn anything or you just didn't like the video. Leave a comment if you have any suggestions for any future videos about any game or game character. My name is Paul of Mitten Squad. Have a wonderful day.